Hey everybody, welcome back to the party. You know where we are, Club 23. Frederick Marks and his lovely, show-stopping, scenes-stealing, party, just halting glasses are, uh, are in the house. Frederick, how are you? I'm doing great. One of your films is showing here. What's, what, what, uh, let's tell everybody about it. Well, the film is called Journey from Zanskar, and it's a 90-minute feature-length documentary about two Tibetan monks who promised the Dalai Lama they're going to do whatever they can to try to save their dying Tibetan culture. So they take 17 small children and they walk over these high Himalayan mountains to get them into Tibetan schools and monasteries in lower India. And we went with them and filmed the whole journey. Wow. So it's like this road tale, it's this trek, this adventure, with kids four years old leaving home possibly forever. So uh, there's the emotional heart of the film is their parents deciding to give up their kids to save their culture and to make a better life for the next generation. You are inspiringly upbeat about it. What's the major thing that you've been able to, to, you know, uh, to pass on to people that ask you about the film? Well, it's inspiring as hell. I yeah. mean, I'm glad that you got that because uh, it's a tortuous journey. They do it for education and, you know, they walk over 17,000 foot passes in the snow led by yaks and, and horses. And I tell you, I had a teacher in Tucson tell me at a screening a week ago, she wants to show this to every kid that she has in her school because as forgotten and abused and ignored as public school kids are, they need to see this film, she said, yeah. because it'll inspire them to want to learn again. Because yeah. they, it'll make them realize that they have all of these opportunities that these kids in Zanskar don't have anything near. Oh, your film's 90 minutes. That's the average dream cycle for a person. That's why films are typically 90 minutes, to catch that attention span. Do you believe that America's attention span, specifically in children, is uh, shrinking, especially with Twitter and everything going on? Definitely. In fact, people tell me that my 90-minute film is way too slow and that they're really looking forward to when I cut it down to a TV hour at 56 minutes. What? Yeah. So, you know, I'm old-fashioned. What can I tell you? I grew up in the 70s enjoying six, eight, ten-hour movies. And I, and I made a film myself that's three hours long. Wow. So there you go. I thank you so much for joining us here on the couch. Hey, it's a pleasure to be here in Orlando again, especially after 16 years. <laughs> well, welcome back. Keep enjoying yourself. Uh, we have a mantra called "Keep," you know, and it is "Keep Orlando Awesome." You're definitely doing that. Enjoy yourself for the rest of the night, and you guys stay locked here because there'll be more coming from Club 23 in just a few minutes. Keep Orlando Awesome. Stay tuned.